Well, folks, it's time to kick it old school. Uh, so you can feel cool. <laughs> Give it to me, baby. <laughs> baby. <laughs> yeah. Sports Center, and if you are a fan of old school basketball, sports period, but for this video, old school basketball, then you are in, you are at, I said in, you are at the right channel, man. This starts off the Battle of the Goat series. Like I said on my um, community tab, this is gonna be the first thing that I want to do with Bird and um, Jordan. I wanted to relive that myself, so I've been, I'm very excited for this, but it's going forward. It's not gonna just be Bird and Jordan, I'm gonna be done, man. We're gonna do seasons. I'm gonna do Bird, Jordan, Bird Magic, um, uh, Mike Magic, you know, Bird Korea. I'm gonna do, you know, we we gonna go seasons on seasons, man. Drop down, you know, some people that y'all would like to see me react to because we're gonna get it done. But you know how we do over here, man. I ain't gonna talk y'all to death. We gonna get straight into that action, man. Then this this is the first time they met up, by the way. Yeah, I, I don't think I ain't even take out a title, but you can see the title. But this is the first time that Jordan and Bird actually met up against each other in the what was that, July 9th, nineteen eighty four. Larry Bird versus Michael Jordan, first meeting ever in 1984. Um, that was like the little Olympic team thing before they kind of started implementing, I think, professional. So I think it was Bird NBA Bird psychological warfare at the drop of a ball. The 84 Olympic team is playing an exhibition game against a bunch of pros, including Larry Bird, and they are in the warm-ups. And a ball bounced down from the college end of the court to the pro end. And Michael Jordan went down to chase it. The ball had to be picked up by Larry Bird. And Michael went up a few feet away from Larry Bird and held out his hands. And Bird took the ball and fired it back down the court over Jordan's head. As if to say, you're not only not getting this ball, I don't give a damn who you are. Larry Bird knows exactly who this guy is and what's going to happen in the next few years. And he wants to get every edge you can get right now. Now, I wouldn't, here's the thing. I, I wouldn't agree in terms of saying Bird knew exactly who this kid was and who he was going to be. I would say that Bird was knowledgeable about him, but nobody could have ever thought that Michael Jordan was going to go on to be exactly what Michael Jordan was. But what I think Larry Bird was just trying to do really was just checking his temperature just to see if you really built like that. To see if 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 you're gonna cry or whine or see if you're gonna take that personally and come out and compete that's what i really think it comes down to or it could have just been bird being an asshole you know however you want to term it but you know me and line up playing nba team <laughs> that's right bird coming up with a loose ball he came to play and they backed him out great Michael takes it anyway. Oh, what a move. Oh, he missed that door. That was a hell of a door. That was still a hell of an attempt, though. This is when basketball is great, man. We need to, man, I think I'm going to, you know what I think I might do? I think I'm going to start my own merch line. And I think that my merch line is going to be make basketball great again. That's what I think my merch game is. He scored like a point that time. He really did. Mikhail has been a real force offensively. Tough pass. Good play by Michael Jordan. Good feedback. It's like when you look at, looking at, they go burn with the mouth with passes. There you go. There is one of the great. Right there. He takes that Wait, somebody. Oh, that was number four who threw it to Bird. My bad. My bad. Makes a steal. Good pass by Jackson. Good job by Michael Jordan. Bro, it's like looking at Jordan. Michael Jordan with that incredible first step. I was like, and look. So I was looking at an interview, um, and and they was asking Bird about Jordan, and he was like, um. They was like, so what was it, or what's something that made Mike so great? And Larry Bird was just saying that his 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 first step was insanely quick, and that's what led to a lot of his dominance. Especially, well, I mean, you can even say that later later on in in his career too. You know what I mean? But then it's like looking at him. I know for sure, for sure, like the early on, you know, early parts of his career, 
it's like I was saying about Bird. It's a un um a un what's the word I want to say? A un um a unrecognized aspect of his game, which was his conditioning. Now I'm looking at a lot of these games that I'm watching with Jordan. He up and down the court, up and down the court, whether it's offense, defense, up and down the court. You know what I mean? And your condition has to be good. And I'm not seeing him huffing and puffing. You know what I mean? Like he's still pretty amped up. He go on this end and play defense and come on the complete opposite other end and come in and do work on the offensive aspect. You know what I mean? Bobby Knight's Olympic team still looking very good, Pete. It was a very excellent half by the uh, by the USA team and certainly by the NBA All-Stars. Quite a competitive second half underway and we'll be back after these important words. USA Olympics versus NBA All-Stars. They look buried. <laughs> you see that? Wait, did Bird just check himself into the game? Or did he all. Uh, hold on. It's like Bird just all uh, gave himself the inbound. Right, competitive second half underway, and we'll be back after these important words for the great halftime show for you. Watch this. He's trying to throw it. He's trying to do the outlet pass. Referee in his way to look at him. So then he, <laughs> he just takes the ball in himself. Out there, the ball the floor. That's some funny stuff, dude. I'm not gonna even lie. Bird just took the ball in himself. And the fact that they didn't even say nothing about it, they just let him go on with it. Jump ball situation. Perkins going up against Bird. Bird gets it. Good hustle by Michael Jordan. Probably not a wise pass by Isaiah. Nothing there. Gets that 2 3 zone, and he gets that outside shooter. The, uh, they don't really have a zone, uh, zone offensive team in there. They're shooting. Alfred, their two best outside shooters, along with uh, Chico. Now they got Alfred in there. Alfred back in. Listen, it was cool. Isaiah wanted that block real bad. Of course, he's had still an excellent defensive player. Michael Jordan. Oh. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, my God. That was the first to come of many posters throughout his career. Man. And the Olympic team still goes without a defeat. Danny Whitman put it up. Thanks to Indiana like that, and that's the ball game. Pete, this is kind of shocking to me. Well, it, 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 the way they did it, it was to me, too, because I didn't expect them to play this well after that game yesterday. Not that they played that badly yesterday, but this was a better team than they played yesterday. Right, they played a better team. They played yesterday. They had to travel, come back to another city. There's Larry Fleischer congratulating Bobby Knight, who has to be very pleased with this one. Now, like I said, I want to, I want to clear up one thing, too, right? So when I say battle of the goats, right, Everybody has their version of who their GOAT may be. Your GOAT may be Mike, your GOAT may be Burr, your GOAT may be Magic, your GOAT may be Kareem, your GOAT may be Bill Russell, your GOAT may be Will Chamberlain, your GOAT might be Kobe Bryant, your GOAT might be LeBron James, your GOAT might be um, whoever, right? So we're not. I'm not doing this to say that Mike is better than Bird or Bird is better than Mike. I'm doing this to admire the greats of our game going up against each other and battling because that's what it's all about at the end of the day. So, you know, I don't want nobody, and you can have your own and root for this person, you know, it's no problem with that. But I'm just saying in terms of me, I'm not doing that to, you know, say that, oh, I think that this person's better than that person. I'm just looking at to see two great players compete. That's all I want to see at the end of the day. But like I said, I told you, man, I got a lot more um, a lot more of this coming. I'm a th I think I'm going to do it by seasons. You know I mean? It's going to be season one. And what better way to start off season one than with Bird, and um and Mike, I think season two might end up being Magic and Burns. I'm pretty sure that's where majority of you guys will be coming because that's just a whole that stems all the way back to college. You know what I mean? But like I said, that is the first time that they met up, man. But it's to hold you guys off up until we get everything coming. Remember, you got these two videos right here. You got these two videos right here, man. Go check them videos out, and I'll see y'all in the next video.